Win rate is literally one of the biggest scams told to you in trading education. Realizing why allowed me and so many others to create consistent trading strategies, even with win rates of less than 50%. You don't need a win rate of over 50% to be profitable. Let's talk all about it after the disclaimer. Now I used to be searching for the highest win rate strategies. I used to try and create the highest win rate strategies from YouTube and stuff like that, but they would never work. I would always be failing. And then I found out this concept, which helped me create a consistent trading strategy around my own preferences. So what is this? Well, let's say we have a trading strategy right now. We want to create a trading strategy and a trader is backtesting their strategy currently and they get one loss. So they take a minus one, fine. Then they get another loss another minus one, then they get another loss, and then they get a plus five. They're overall profitable, but the win rate is 25% because they won one and lost three. Let's say they then lose again, minus one, another one, another one, another one, another one, another one, plus 12. So what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine losses, and 17 plus 17 on the win. So that would be what plus six. So their overall RR is plus six. So they're still profitable, even though they lost so many more trades than they won. So right now I have this set up and let's quickly rewind the chart to here. Let's say that a trader takes a loss right here, right? They want to enter into a buy position off of this demand zone take it maybe to this high and they get a loss. So they get stopped out and they want to enter into a buy position off of this demand zone. They get stopped out and another loss. And then they want to enter into a buy position from this demand zone and they get stopped out. It's another loss. And finally they want to enter into a buy position from this demand zone. And again, we could target the highs from all these trades. So right now this would be the structural high and they get a win. Now this win is a plus 5.24. The risk reward ratio is 5.24. So that's plus 5.24 RR. And these can all be minus ones. So minus one, minus one, minus one. Even though we lose more than we win, the overall RR is still positive. That's plus 2.24 RR. So a trader's win rate is less than 50%. It's 25% in this case. The overall RR of the strategy is positive. So it doesn't totally matter what the win rate is of a strategy, as long as the wins are big enough to overtake the losses. Now it's important to understand if a trader is doing a prop firm or something like that, maybe they don't want to take six losses in a row because maybe that would be failing for a prop firm. Now, without the right concepts, it'll be very challenging to achieve the necessary RR to actually have a working strategy where the wins are much bigger than the losses. We've actually included a free smart money course that you can get access to in the video description. It's important to significantly backtest any strategy a trader creates. This not only allows for the trader to understand many of the risks of trading, but for the trader to potentially set themselves apart from many of the losing traders. You can learn about how traders do that by clicking on the video in the description. But that's the video. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.